Hi everybody. We are back today after a very long time since I've gotten to really sit down and just chat with you guys. First of all, this cookie's warm, probably. Mm -hmm. I figured it was since it was in that box. Pretty good. Okay, so... Last time we talked, there was like boy things. Well, he apparently does drugs, so I don't talk to him now. But like, there was a situation, I don't think I've ever said his name on here. He had like an overdose. I had to call 911. And um, you know, this isn't my apartment. I hate talking about this in a mukbang. I feel bad though. That I am. Um, if you want a KFC mukbang of more of me showing the food, then like, I have plenty of KFC mukbangs on this channel. Ooh, looky there. I love that gravy on the lid. Mmm. Smells so good too. But like, I feel stupid. You know, I feel like. Why did I do that? And it's also like the lowest low in the sense of like, you know, this isn't my apartment, this is my cousin's. I feel like I really disrespected her, even though I didn't do anything, because I didn't know that, you know, anything like that was going on. And, um, because I don't mess with stuff like that, but I don't know, I just know how she feels now, and I hate that she feels that way. I don't hate the fact that I feel like I did that. Because her and Anna are my best friends. This is really good. Do you see this cheese on top? Mmm. I don't even really like cheese. I'm like, yes, Gaga, fuck me up. I've always mixed mashed potatoes, gravy, and corn together anyways, so yes. This is amazing. But if someone wasn't to like corn, I wonder if you can ask them to make it without corn. This is very fresh, I wonder why. It's about 5 p.m., that's probably why. And the one I went to has a buffet, so they're probably going through stuff pretty fast at this time. Mm. Oh, we didn't get any good chocolate action. You can see that it is though. But you know. I don't know. Now every time I look at somebody and like, I'm like, oh you're cute, but I'm like, oh who knows like what's wrong with you, like. <laughs> so kind of just back to like, being single and being okay with that for right now. People fucking suck, don't they? Kind of like mentally unstable too, in the sense of like, not having very good thoughts about myself at the moment. Not like you know, something creepy or whatever, bro. Mm. Fuck me up with that gravy. 
So we have some chicken strips too. Can you hear that? I'll do this in. I love Simon came out recently too. I love that movie. It's so good. I don't think I had talked about that in my any of my videos other than that until now. But I really liked that movie. No. This is also kind of why I haven't filmed a mukbang either, because I've done a lot of the fast foods, especially all the ones near me. Mm. And that's like, I have so much going on in my brain. Because I had some people pass away in my family close to me. By people, I mean one, and it was really close to me, but that happened too, and with work things are going on, I think basically the same thing was since last time we talked though, they keep on promoting people below me to above me, and skipping over me. And, um, don't have time for that. Mm. This is good. I really wanted to get like a cheesecake. I went to Target to get my, oh, I'm drinking fruit punch. I went to Target to get that before KFC because it's by each other. When I would walk in with like the Target bags, they was all like looking at me as if I had murdered their entire family or something. Like not like the workers, but the other customers. I'm like, have you never seen a Target bag before? Like. I have a moped, I'm not going to leave it like sitting outside by my moped. So like, yeah, I have some Target bags with me, get the fuck over it. We also have a meeting tomorrow with our apartment complex. I thought having had to call 911. And um, don't know what that means exactly yet. That's tomorrow. I know they can kick you out for that. And if they do, then. I don't know. I don't really have a plan. Like, yeah, my friend Anna would let me stay with her, but, like, that's in Greentown, and I would have to quit my job because they're not going to let me transfer because my store is so understaffed, they would try to keep me there. I already know they would. It's something that's happened before when I moved here. And I ended up getting it to work out, but... I would have to quit my job. And, um, there isn't very many places to get a job in Greentown. That and I would go back to, like, 
green town, like living in small towns, like give me like crippling depression, you know? And that's what, like, the constant state I would be in. This is like one of the weirdest eating shows I've ever done. I don't know why. It's like the 12th time I've been KFC too. It sounded so good though and I really needed it. Chicken strips taste weird. It kind of tastes like a cardboard box. And this doesn't smell like a cardboard box, so I don't know. I mean, it is a cardboard box, but it doesn't smell like it. Oh, is that what happened to my... I don't really like their mashed potatoes and gravy like this anymore. They never give nearly enough gravy is why. What am I doing? I mean, I'm 23, living at my best friend's. And like, sitting at a dead end job, like, expecting something to change when it never will. I mean, yeah, I like do YouTube videos, but like that's never going to go anywhere. I enjoy doing them, that's why I still do them. I don't do them to like get rich off YouTube because that's not gonna happen. When someone dies, I always tell myself, I'm like, one of the main things I remember is like, you know, it's just more motivation to like, try to have a better life and like, make sure that they would be proud of me. That's what I always try to do. But like, what have I done that like, you know? I mean, I guess I'm not a like, complete fuck up. Like, I could be, like, a thief and, like, on drugs and alcohol and, like, everything under the sun and be a total fuck up and homeless and stuff, but I guess I'm not that, at least. I don't even drink alcohol, let alone, like, drugs, so. I don't even smoke cigarettes. So that's good, I guess.
feel like this is gonna be like a really cringy video when I watch it in like 10 years. I can't even be bothered to sit up right now. I have slash had today off work. It's pretty late in the day. My manager asked me to come in and work early tomorrow and then I'm like, I was like, originally I was like, yeah, and then like literally like two minutes later I remembered I had a meeting tomorrow and I'm like, oh, nope, sorry, I can't do that. <laughs> Which actually I would have rather worked early. But I have a meeting so I can't, I have to work four to probably about midnight, which then go in the next morning. I hate that shit. supposed to start raining soon too otherwise I would like go to the gym and like tear through everything it's what I'm doing what, what I would what I would be doing in my mind just really like going to town on that like bike that I have there but I can't because I have a moped and it's raining soon and my moped doesn't work in the rain like it won't start. Not only that, but it wouldn't work for a couple days. Did I eat everything? Oh, I have two more chicken strips left. Honestly, all I want to do is go to sleep now. Not because I ate, because I'm not the type of person that gets sleepy because I ate, but just to pass my time. I've like been watching YouTube videos all day. I got up at about 9.30. So I've been up for, I guess, about eight hours. I've watched about as many YouTube videos as I can. <laughs> I need to shave. What I really need is like infinite amounts of monies and like get new clothes and like I would love to be like able to dress more of how I want. Clothes are not cheap though. Are they Jasper? Well, I guess that's going to be the end of my video then. If you haven't watched my last one, I really enjoyed my last one. It was where I, I had every frappuccino at Starbucks. <gasps> oh. And, um, 
I'll be more energetic on my next video. Probably. I just needed to talk about some things. I didn't really ever, like, fully, I guess, go into, like, the story of what happened, but... I don't know. I mean, you guys know what's happened with that guy. And then, um... There was some other lies, like, the ex wasn't his ex. They were actually still together. And the ex messages me today and was like, um, no regrets, had fun, or something like that. And I'm like, literally it takes everything in me not to mess. I didn't reply. I, no, no thank you. I have nothing to say to you. First of all, that's the ex, so like, I don't care about you. Like, I never did. Like, I don't know why I would. And I'm like, literally, like, of course you have no regrets. You're not the one who's in, like, the situation. Or, you like, you've already fucked up your life enough, like. I guess that's the end of my video. I'll see you guys later.